Yeah. Yo, what's going on, everybody? It's your boy iPod King Carter here. I'm here to update you guys on my NBA All Net. Now, I told you guys in the last video that I wanted a All Mythic team, and I didn't know how I was gonna go about it until I found out a little bit more information about Fusion, as well as how many coins it would take me to get to my ultimate goal. Now, what I'm about to do real fast is I'm about to start the process of getting another Mythic card. Now, what you guys will see here is I have D-Wade, Carmelo Anthony, and Shaquille O'Neal. Now, these are my three active Mythics, and I still have Dirk Nowinski in the tuck. I won him from a fusion, by the way. I'll tell you guys more information about that real soon. And I do still have my old gold uh, fully decked out legendary cards. And I still have Kobe and LeBron. So when it comes to pieces, I have over 200 universal pieces and I have over 400 mythic pieces. Now the trick to getting mythic pieces is to fuse, fuse, fuse. Fuse any legendary card you get. The ones you get from a free draw every couple of uh, days, make sure you take it, put it in a tuck, don't use it for coaching, and then fuse it with other uh, legendary cards that you may win out of draws, and play as many legendary matches as you can. So, right now I have LeBron James or Kobe Bryant, they're both a 94 overall, but it seems like I'll only need to use 255 pieces to get Kobe Bryant, whereas though I would have to use 275 pieces for LeBron James. So, as of right now, the details on Kobe, this is the skill set that he'll have and the chemistry that he'll have as well. I'm gonna go ahead and combine them. Now, Kobe Bryant has been claimed. So, right now I have 216 pieces and I need 275 for LeBron, so I will not be able to get LeBron today. But what I can do is I can start Kobe on his journey to become one of my favorite mythics. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna select him and I'm gonna start his evolution training as well as, oh, matter of fact, I'm sorry. Let me go back, let me go to his rank. That's what I wanna rank up. I wanna, I wanna rank him up first. And I'll deal. I'll deal with the uh, the levels once I change my lineup. Let's see. Rank up. Okay. It's gonna take about nine minutes. So let's work for about five of that real fast. So first thing I want to do is I want to take this Kobe Bryant out, and I want to replace him with let's say J.R. Smith. Now what I want to do is I want to go back. I want to go to matches, go to league. Um, I'm going to go ahead and grab a nice little reward. I'm going to need those little bit of diamonds. Go back, go to my lineup, and take him out of my lineup. Replace him with J.R. Smith. Now, as I go back, it's pro tips. Pro tips only. What I'm doing here is I'm going to go and transfer XP from one card to another. So the card receiving XP will be my Kobe Bryant. The card to give the XP will be this Kobe Bryant. Now, I have seven special transfers left, all right? And I'm gonna use those seven to get my player to a level 60, all right? Now, Kobe Bryant is now at a level 60 mythic. And my legendary Kobe Bryant, which is maxed out in every category, is now back to level one. So, what I'm gonna do here is, I'm gonna go to matches. Now remember, I told you guys about pro tips. I'm gonna go back to league, go back to my lineup, and I'm gonna put that Kobe Bryant that is now level one back in my lineup. Now, the reason why I have all these level ones in my lineup and I don't have anybody else, like my mythic cards that I have, is because league is totally different from regular play. So now, I'm gonna go back to my regular play, and I'm gonna replace him and put the mythic Kobe Bryant in. Now, at this stature, Kobe Bryant isn't that great, and you guys know why. So in training, 
gonna go ahead and start training this Kobe Bryant. All right, and it's gonna take almost 30 hours for him to even raise one level. Now, back to this. I'm going to waste as many diamonds as I can to get his rank up, all right? Now, the reason why I do this quickly is because the diamonds that are taken up right here, right now, really don't matter to me, all right? Eight diamonds, I can spend eight diamonds. I can, I can stomach losing eight diamonds. 24 diamonds, I can stomach losing 24 diamonds. Oh, but it ain't over. 46 diamonds, I'm gonna stomach that. I'm gonna stomach that, man. I'm gonna, I'm gonna go ahead and take that one to on the chin. All right, not enough gold, all right? So I need 800,000 pieces of gold, right? Let me show you how much gold is gonna cost me. 20 diamonds, right? For just 100,000, and this number is going to go up, all right? So what I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy, I'm gonna buy it again. All right, now I'm at 100 diamonds per 100. 120, 140, 160 diamonds. Now I only have 500 diamonds left, all right? I'm gonna rank them up and look how many diamonds it cost to finish this out right now. I will not spend 286 diamonds here. I will wait the 12 hours all right so we're gonna go back we're gonna check it out kobe bryant level six in rank d way seven in rank both of those guys need to be raised up to eight within the next i would say the next week it's gonna take me about a week to do that now that i've lost all those diamonds and stuff now let me go over to my tasks Make sure I got everything. Okay, so I need a hundred. So let's see. I can coach a position, upgrade a piece of gear, or I can develop a card. I'm gonna go to develop a card because I because I need those extra diamonds. Now I have three thousand diamonds. So what I'm gonna do is the potential factor. This is where it's at. I'm gonna develop potential for D weight. I'm gonna max him out. All right. Now, what I mean by this is, I'm gonna try to finish him all the way out here. Let's see if I can do that. Max out his potential. His potential is 1,000. It's gonna, gonna take me a little bit longer, but it's okay. I'm doing it for you guys. I'm giving you guys all pro tips here. This is, this is how you wanna build your team. You don't wanna just put a whole bunch of mythics together. Now, I can talk to you guys about that mythic Dirk while I do this now what came of that mythic Dirk was I put together five 84 overall cards it was two Julius Irvings no yeah 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 two Julius Irvings but it was three uh, Hakeem Olajuwans I put those five together and I was able to fuse together those cards and they gave me a Dirk for that now I can't use Dirk in my lineup so Dirk is just gonna sit there until I fuse together another set of dope 84 overall cards it may take me about a month to do that it may take a week it may take two months it just depends on what the draws are like at the, when I play legendary matches so that right there maxes out Dwayne Wade's potential and now I can get my my 50 diamonds out of that now with the development I can do two more cards I can develop Kobe and Shaq and and still have probably about five development points so for every card that I've been using as a mythic and I've been using that uh, transfer feature they just been giving it back to me you know just just like a little bit of kickback so Go back home. Let's go to shop, see what type of cards I can get here. Alright, so this is free. I'll take that. I'm gonna go ahead and alright, gonna grab that Abaka. When you whenever you're doing these draws, another pro tip. 
always go for the highest one because when you're using them for coaching, like you need the highest cards. So let's see if I can get some out here. Come on. Alright, there it goes. And we're gonna confirm on that. Alright, now we need to put the shooting guard up to 29. All right, and we're good on that. Okay, so we confirm on those. Now, remember when I told you about the uh, the fuse? The fusion is crazy the way it works. So let me show you guys for it, and then JR. All right. All right. So I'm gonna confirm these cards for fusion, right? Check this out. I have three of these David Robinsons, right? And I have one Mythic Dirt that gives me 92. But this Ibaka is a 75. But I could possibly, it's all about possibilities. I could possibly get a Vince Carter, a Westbrook, or a Ginobili, but I don't need those players. So I would not fuse together these current players. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to save these players for a later draft so i could probably pull out maybe like if like say for instance right i fuse together not using dirt if i confirm this right if i confirm this i can get any of these cards but guess what i get in return i get 30 mythic pieces and that's what i've been doing lately i've just been fusing together every piece of player i have so let's go back to cards, let's go to pieces. All right, so 49, 49, 49, 69. He's 121. He only needs 98. Okay, so this Melo only needs 94, so I mean 74. So I'll combine him and I'll get another piece. I'm saying another card out of that to fuse together 135, 92, 111. Okay, so. All right, this dirt is worth 80, so I can buy him over to Westbrook because that's one more point better for the uh, fusion. All right, and I only have 43 pieces left, so I can't use any of that to get any cards. So I have to just wait until I build my catalog more, and then I'll be good. All right, now... What do I have to do? Let's play some. Let's play some legendary matches. Now remember, I told you guys, make sure you always play everything in gold. Always play everything in gold. You know, even if you get some lucky pulls, you get some lucky pulls. I'm telling you, you'll be the happiest person in the world, yo. Like I've had many, many lucky pulls, man. I pulled a matter of fact, speaking of which. I played, I think it was either Allison, I, uh, Allen's, Iverson's uh, joint, and I got a, I got like a, a little uh, legendary AI, 82 overall joint. Like that joint came in the clutch. Use him, use him for a little fusion. Yo, your, your luck got your luck factor gotta be on, on a thousand. To get these things. Like I just like I just be tapping the screen, trying to trying to bait it out. Like you know what I'm saying like I like what I do is like with four fingers, I kind of like tap everywhere on the screen just to see if like oh look at that, and I wanted to tap the middle on that, but like you just gotta have gotta have mad luck, yo. <clears throat> like I might be done for the day on NBA All Net. Uh, hop and uh by the way, more pro tips. Um hop on NBA All Net maybe five times a day. That's all that's all you need. Um once every I would say every four hours. Once every four hours you should get the best experience 
in NBA all that. Now what I mean by that is I hop on at 6 a.m., hop again on at 10, hop again on um, round two, then again around like six, and then I hop on at 9.30 for All-Star uh, Weekend Challenge. Well, they call it All-Star Challenge, but I hop on for that, as well as I stay on for about another hour. And then I play the uh, club tour. So I make sure that I'm on, and then, like, I don't get on again until, like, early in the a.m. So my stamina would be reloaded. Um, I can play Road to Glory again. I can play tournament matches, you know. But, yeah, every four hours... It should be able to get you some nice tournament match skips and everything. But uh, it looks like it's it for me. <clears throat> Allies have all been encouraged for the day. Yep, all my daily goals are done. So I'm only one player away from a truly mythic team. And then after I get this one player... Then I have to work towards getting more of the same cards in my lineup to use as catalysts. Now, what I mean by catalysts are for evolution. So if you select the card to evolve, it will need two of the same cards to evolve to the next one. Now with this mellow, all stats plus 20, potential points plus 50. So, you know, I gotta work hard to get these cards. So I'm gonna be playing this game every day. But I want to thank you guys for watching. I hope, it, I hope my videos help. Uh, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section and I'll be sure to answer them. Uh, make sure you leave the video a like and uh, share on Twitter. I'm going to highlight you guys in the next one. This is IKC signing out. Peace.